Hey YouTube, Zero Tech Skills here. Uh, it's been a while since I made a video, but I acquired some silver bullion, which I am really excited about, and I just want to share with you guys. Um, I purchased these uh, five ounce America the Beautiful uh, silver bullion about oh a month ago. Um, silver was about thirty five, thirty six dollars an ounce. Um, and as of today, April uh, 10th, 2011, it's about $41 an ounce. So, um, so uh, silver has gone up dramatically. Um, uh, I was able to find these for a good price, and I, I just couldn't, I couldn't say no. It was one of those, one of those things. Um, and I am really happy that I did. The key came in. Um, the quality was was phenomenal. Um, actually, thinking about sending them back to PCGS to have them regraded but as of right now I'm really happy with them um, and if silver does go up in price I will probably will send them in for a, for a regrade but but yeah let me just show you what, what the coins look like um, they're they look just like the quarters um, except bigger here's a here's a 90 percent silver uh, America the Beautiful Quarter right there. It's uh it's one inch diameter. Uh these these bad boys are uh three inches in diameter. Um and on the back they have the national parks. Um this one happens to have Yosemite, that's in California. Um let's see, this one has Yellowstone out of Wyoming. This bad boy has, let's see, the Grand Canyon in Arizona. If you could pick that up. Uh, this is Mount Hood in Oregon. And this is the Hot Springs in Arkansas. Sorry about the glare and the plastic. The plastic doesn't really show off the coin. Um, kinds of, it kind of leaves it hazy a little bit, but other than that, I mean... The coins are in great condition. Um, stack them here real quick. So yeah, so uh, like I said, I'm really happy with my acquisition. I've been actually hunting these down, and then I just found a guy <clears throat> that was willing to part with his. I don't know if money was tight or fell in some hard times, but he gave me a great deal on them. And uh, like I said, I couldn't say no. Um, yeah, these are three inches in diameter, like I said. Um, this little guy is only an inch in diameter, so you can see the size comparison here. Um, the American Eagle, 1.5 inches in diameter, so it's about half the size. Um, what else? Uh, I supposedly they only made 33,000 of each coin um, in the first year set here, so that equals to about 165,000 in total. Um, let's see, what else? Uh, they they are point nine 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 five sil fine silver, um, and that's about it. Um, they have uh, an inscription on the side here, but you can't really see you can't see through the plastic at all. Actually, um, it says uh, point nine 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 five uh, fine silver, um, five ounces. Um, but yeah, these are um, these are the quarters here. For the 2010 set, I'm still waiting on my 2011 sets from the mint. But um, then they come in these little uh, little mint packages. Um, but yeah, like I said, I'm really happy that I was able to find these five ounce uh, bullion. Um, and unfortunately, with the, or fortunately, with the price of silver going up, I do not know if I'm going to be able to afford the next set. But um, as it stands. Like I said, I'm happy with this set. Um, I don't know, maybe if silver goes down, um, which I hope it does, so uh, more people can buy more silver. But I will be buying more of these five ounces um, and more uh, more bullion in general. But but anyway, glad to be making another video. Um, I hope you guys like this little uh, overview of the. Uh, a new uh, silver acquisition and um, thanks again for watching and I'll see you next time